asking me, how in the world do I do my read alouds? Hi, Miss Skelly here. So I've had a lot of people direct message me on Instagram or TikTok um, who follow my YouTube and they've been asking me, how in the world do I do my read alouds? And so today I'm going to show you so the first thing I do is I take any book that I want to scan and using my notes app, I actually can scan each page into a PDF. Now, here's the thing to keep in mind. There's usually a max, I think it's like 24 or 25 scans per PDF. But once I have scanned the chapters that I plan on using, I will then upload it to my computer using AirDrop. Okay, I'm back on my phone now, and I'm going to show you how to record on Zoom. And I will just say a disclaimer, some people have told me that they don't have this feature. Um, my school does pay for I guess it's like the premium Zoom or whatever you want to call it. So I'm not sure if this feature is in like the basics of Zoom. So please note that's a disclaimer. But again, I'm just teaching how I record and maybe someone else has a better way. I know there's lots of other ways to have like a green screen background, um, but this is just the way that I do it. So now I am recording on Zoom so I can, oops, sorry, my classroom is a mess. <laughs> So I can show you a better idea of what I do once I scanned. I have my PDF, I've sent it to me. You can also just email it to yourself. Um, here is what I do next. Okay, this is jumping ahead and this is how I set it up on Google Slides. So these are actually all images. Now you're probably wondering, okay, well, how do I go from PDF to JPEG? Let me show you. So I use a website called um, smallpdf.com, there's actually several different websites that you could use, just Google like PDF to JPEG. And what I do is I just get my JPEG, I just convert it, um, or I get my PDF, I convert it into a JPEG. And once I have that file, I'm able to open up Google Slides and I can just kind of plug in my now images and voila, there is all of my all of my chapters right there. Um, and I'm not sure if Zoom will let me share this, but I might jump back on my phone to show you. So yeah. Okay, so oh, there we are back on Zoom. So I want to share my screen, right? And I forgot to mention this earlier, but when you save your slides, you wanna save it as a Microsoft PowerPoint because, so I wanna share my screen, getting ready to record. You wanna to go to advanced and click PowerPoint as a virtual background. And then you'll have your PowerPoint. So that's the one I had downloaded. I'm gonna record chapter 63, 68. And my screen is so dirty. <laughs> Embarrassing, sorry everybody. Um, but it'll be like preparing PowerPoint and there I am everybody, hello. And that is how I am able to be in the slides with my story in my background. Stand up, move around. See if you move around too much, you'll kind of get cut out. So yeah. And then I just am able to click through my slides like so and I enjoy recording on zoom because if I'm ever reading and I'm like I, I need a break whether it's to go to the bathroom or drink some water I can just pause my recording so yeah